Local 3 Sports with Jake Duran. Today, members of the Michigan Tech football program were in Crystal Falls hosting a fundamentals camp. The camp was broken down into two sessions with players ranging from fifth grade all the way up to the high school level. There are strong ties between Forest Park High School and Michigan Tech University. I'm actually a Michigan Tech alumni. I played football up there from 2006 to, I believe, 2010. Um, Coach Phil Milgrath from Tech, I played with him. And just a good relationship, uh, Coach Dan Metlack, the new head coach at Michigan Tech. Uh, the field is here is actually named after his grandpa, uh, Richard Metlack. So just a lot of, lot of local ties and a lot of ties from college and just throughout the years of football. That strong relationship was on full display Tuesday afternoon during the Michigan Tech football fundamentals camp held at Forest Park High School. Several Michigan Tech football players and Michigan Tech assistant coach Philip Milbrath were on hand to help build a strong foundation for youth players. At this age, you're teaching a lot of fundamentals, right, and teaching the guys from the ground up. Literally, some of them tying their football cleats on for the first time today. So uh, being able to teach things at a very low level and, and watch growth happen over two days is, is exciting. And more at the college level, guys are more refined, and you're, and you're really working every single day just to improve little by little as to where with these guys, you know, you can watch extreme growth kind of early on, you know, even through just a couple of drills. Uh, fundamentals in football are very important. Uh, Got to stress out of the at a young age, so when they get to the next level, and even some lucky enough to be at the, the next level, it all comes down to fundamentals. When you're in a game, when you're tired, when everything's chaotic around you, you have to be able to rely on your fundamentals. So to teach them at a young age, it, it's a building block for their entire uh, football career and future. The camp is free for local athletes thanks to the support of the Mark Nyland Memorial Fund. Mark was a trainer dedicated countless hours and years to the Forest Park athletics, not just football, but all athletics. And uh, Mark ended up passing away and they set up a memorial fund in his name and camps like this. Uh, Lexi Gussard has a basketball camp this summer. Um, funds all help uh, local youth be able to participate in these camps. Coach Milbrath says investing in the youth is a top priority for the football program and the university. You know, even being two hours away here down in Crystal Falls from Michigan Tech, this is considered the backyard, right? So we want to make sure we're, we're doing our part in, and um, expanding our community, you know what I mean there, and, and making sure that everybody from the UP understands that Michigan Tech is a great option for them. And as they grow up and if they aspire to be college football players, that, hey, not only with a great degree, but also a great football experience up there as well. So um, like I said earlier, with, with a lot of these younger guys, getting a chance to meet our, our current players and develop relationships with those guys, I think hits a little bit closer to home than just uh, – you know, hearing the, you know, watching Michigan Tech on, on the TV or hearing them on the radio, right? So. The Michigan Tech football fundamentals camp runs through Wednesday, June 28th.